Yeah! Hola gang and welcome again to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, I'm your old nerd of the day, and I try things so you don't have to. I am at Taco Bell. It is January 26th, the official release day of the brand new limited time Naked Chicken Chalupa. First caught wind of this a uh, few weeks back online, started looking into it, started reading about it, sounded very interesting. To me, what this sounds like is Taco Bell's take on a chicken sandwich. They thought, we need our own chicken sandwich just like everybody else does, so what we'll do is we'll take a chicken sandwich, but we'll make it undeniably our own, put our own Taco Bellish chicken sandwich twist on it. Now, Taco Bell's idea of a chalupa is not a traditional chalupa. Taco Bell's is like this thick, deep fried wheat gordita shell. And you can go down the rabbit trail of what a taco is, chalupa is, gordita is. That's what the internet's for. Go out to Wikipedia. Going to the clipboard of fluff, the naked chicken chalupa is made up of four ounces of marinated white meat chicken with Mexican spices and seasoning, shredded lettuce, diced tomatoes, cheddar cheese, and a creamy avocado ranch sauce. There's the bag it came in. And I went in and grabbed a bunch of napkins. And there's the damage on it. And here is how it comes. All wrapped up in here. Let's look inside. It smells nice. There is the little cardboard naked chicken container. And look, it's all filled up. It's all filled up, just like on the sign. That is impressive right there. I love the look of the shell. The chicken is nicely, nicely fried. Very thick too. Check out how thick that shell is. And unlike some people, I am not naked doing this review. Woo -woo -woo -woo. All right, let's give it a shot. There's a look at that white meat chicken inside. Just as a side note, I originally thought that this was going to be a shell of chicken that was filled with beef. I, th I thought, okay, they just made like a chalupa, but they just substituted the chicken for the bread. Not so. I am impressed with how filled up this actually is. That chicken shell has a really nice crunch to it. It's it's tender inside with that crunch on the outside. Uh, the seasoning on it is is spicy. It, it's got some heat to it, so it's got a little bit of a kick. If you're if you're not expecting it, it's it's kind of a surprise. I wasn't expecting it. Then you have all the traditional stuff that you'd find on a Taco Bell gordita taco or chalupa. The the diced tomatoes are nice. The the crispy lettuce. The cheese is kind of halfway melty. Just you know, par for the course stuff, and it's done well. I'm kind of thankful for the avocado ranch sauce. I think that's probably helping cool it down a little bit because it, it it it's just a slow burn in my mouth right now. Compared to their other offerings of tacos and chalupas, it's a little bit on the smaller side, uh, but they make up for it with the having so much of the other ingredients inside. And if you get it and it's pitiful, take it back, have them do it right. The damage on this was $2.99. I think a little bit high. Uh, I would lower this down to $1.99 if it was me. On the Nerdometer, I would give the Taco Bell Naked Chicken Chalupa, um, I think I would give this a low I like it. it, it I, I'm kind of torn. It's a neat concept. It's a nice twist on a chicken sandwich, and they seem to have pulled it off just fine. The heat is the biggest distraction for me. I think that without it, there would be a lot of really nice flavors coming through, but because of it, I'd never know that. They were just too heavy-handed on the the spices, the seasonings that made this hot. But that's just my personal take on it. 
because of the heat. I know a lot of you guys like the spicy stuff, the, the stuff that just burns your mouth off. So maybe you're going to absolutely love this. And if you have tried the Naked Chicken Chalupa, Put it down in the comments. Let me know what you thought. Like I said, this is a limited time item, so if you want to grab it, you need to do it as soon as you can. They also put it in a big box, one of their $5 big boxes. So for $5, you can get one of these, a Doritos Loco Taco, a regular taco, and a drink. There you go, gang. Another review in the bag. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And remember, I put out videos every Sunday, Tuesday and Friday. You can find me on my social networks at Twitter, Facebook, Instagram at Old Nerd Reviews. And you can become a part of the Old Nerd Crony community. You guys have a freaking awesome day and I'll see you next video. Bye now.